Leslie here with this week's new releases in our shop, Run With Craft Scissors on Etsy. Um, don't forget to use the discount code thank you 15 for 15% 15 off. So first off, these new releases will be in the shop on Friday, May 13th. I know Friday the 13th um, at 7 a.m. Central Standard Time. The first one I'm going to show you is a bookmark. And what's really unique about this one, I'm not sure if it's going to show up, is that I used a glittery gel pen on this one. So it's a sparkly black, but I feel like I'm not sure if it's gonna come up or not. But you can definitely see it in person. There's like glitter within the font, so that's really fun. And you can order it laminated or not laminated, and you can order it with a tab to like snap into your planner or without one. That's totally up to you. So that's the first thing. We call these ones bookmarks because you could just buy them like as normal and use them as a bookmark, honestly. So I believe in myself and my abilities. I just recently took a like strength finder survey for work. So I feel like I need to like believe in my strengths. So that's what kind of inspired this one. So I hope you are aware of some of your strengths. Okay, next up I have a new cherry. This time I did a single cherry by itself. Isn't it so cute? So dark red and then I went with a dark green stem and then I put mine on a regular green clip but it would look cute on red or a mini as well. The back is red, in case you wanted to know. Some people ask, some people don't think it's covered. It's definitely covered. So here you go, we have a little red cherry coming to the shop. And then, because you guys know I like to coordinate things, I have a cherry tied bow coming to the shop as well. Now this one's leaves are a little bit more, I wouldn't say lime green, but more like a green apple green for the leaves on the stem. But I still put it on a green clip. So, but it's mostly a white ribbon. And I will try to tie it smaller if you order on a mini clip, just so it looks right. <laughs> um, the back is also covered on our bows as well, in case you wanted to know, but it has cute little cherries all around it. So adorable. My mom's favorite fruit during the summer is cherries. I still remember we would only buy cherries from cherry stands. <laughs> okay, another thing we like to do during the summer, and maybe a lot of people do all year, I just tend to, I tend to find more of the time during the summer is go to the movies. So I made a little popcorn container. I thought that was adorable. So it's just a simple red container, but it's got those little popcorn kernels. Of course they're buttered, like of course. And then I put mine on a regular red paper clip. And then the back is also red on this one. I got lots of red, a lot of red going on. So there you go. So I would love to know what your favorite movie is in the comments. That's what I would love to know. I actually recently just watched one of my favorites on Mother's Day. It's When Harry Met Sally. That's one of my like favorite chick flicks. And I think I actually did a plan with me where I went through my top 10 chick flicks and then you guys commented yours and I was like, oh man, no, that one is better than that one. Yeah, and so it was funny because I was like, I was like trying to edit my list. All right, next up we have, let's go with some flowers. Let's bring in some flowers. So I have a bunch of new flowers. Now, quantities are limited on these, so if you want one, make sure you snag it right away. So I have this cream one. They have a pearl in the middle with beads going around it. And I put this one on copper. I just thought the cream looked good on copper. And then the next one I have is kind of a cream with blue stripe. So if you're a big fan of blue, this one has more pointed petals. But once again, has that little pearl in the middle with beads around it. And then the next one I have, this one is so pretty. Okay, so this kind of reminds me of like a succulent, but it's not, it's definitely a flower. But it's got some watercolored greens all over it. And so I put it on a green paper clip. But isn't that just gorgeous? I love that one. It's got kind of a cream tinge to it as well. And then the next one I'm gonna show you, totally different, <laughs> except for the center. It's pink, look how cute. I put this one on a white because I thought it would make the center pop because it's also white. So that one's really pretty. I like that one. This one has three layers, three layers of petals. So cute. And then the next one, this is the last like layered flower. This one has those like vintage vibes. It has like a floral print all over it, if you guys can see. It's kind of got some purples in it, mostly purples in that middle one. A little bit of pink here, but it's got that pearl center and the gold beading around it. So I put this one on gold. I just really like the way that looked. All right, next up, okay, I'll do one more flower. I'll show you one more flower. I'm releasing another mini. This one is in light pink. I'm gonna have to hold it in my hand because it's so tiny. This one's in light pink. I put it on a green clip like a flower and then has a gold bead in the middle. Adorable. All right, and then a lot of you asked for the freebie from Mother's Day to be put in the shop as a custom so you could pick your color of glitter for your hearts. I still have to finagle my listing. Um, you might have to personalize it in like where you type it out because 
when I do custom orders, it usually only lets me pick like one color of glitter and I want you to be able to pick two. So I'm gonna have to finagle that one around, but there you go. So this was the freebie last week and I'm going to be listing it as a custom where you can pick your color of the big heart and the little heart. So we'll have to be very specific to make sure we know what we're talking about, but I'll have pictures of all of the glitter in the listing so you just have to like swipe through the pictures so you can pick your color of glitter that you want okay you can also pick the same color for both hearts that's fine too that's fine too okay so that's a custom and then next up i did have a request for this one i've been doing these little new bows and i got a request to do a simple black and white one because it's classic you know so it goes with a lot of spreads and i always do my like monthly word clip in black and white so i think that's one of the reasons too so black glitter on white cardstock it's that really thick sturdy white cardstock and I put mine on a mini black paper clip but it's sparkly all right last one not the freebie last one <laughs> it's kind of a monstera leaf this year I did it in teal I wanted it in teal because a kit that I did last year and I think I may have held on to it um, had a teal monstera leaf and I was like oh because mine was like lime and green apple I think I went like bright with it last year. So I'm doing a little bit of a contrast color here. This one's got cute little holes in it. It is two layers. So that second layer that you're seeing is white glitter. So it's still all glittery and sparkly. And then I put it on the new teal paper clip because I thought that would be fun. And you can order on a regular or mini paper clip. Either one, either one. All right, this week's freebie is really unique. I can't promise like what colors yours is gonna be because it's kind of a wild watercolor paper. So here's the one I made. They'll all have a yellow sparkly center because it's a flower. But mine has like, see there's like a little bit of yellow and orange and purple. There's blue on some of them. I should have made more than one. Maybe I will when I do like the listing photo for the freebie. Um, I'll probably make another one. So that's this week's freebie. The back is purple because a lot of them had like little tinges of purple. So I just went with purple as the background. And then that sparkly yellow center. So I thought this would be a fun summery flower. So there you go. That is this week's new releases. I would love to know what your favorites are and they will be in the shop, like I said, on Friday, May 13th at 7 a.m. Central Standard Time. Also in my Insta stories, I usually set like a countdown so you can like have a reminder. Instagram will remind you, so that's kind of fun. All right, thank you guys so much for watching and hanging out with me and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.